If you're headed out to the Celtic Festival this evening, temperatures are in the mid 80s right now. We'll drop them into the 70s as we the event continues on. Overall, it is a little humid out there, but mostly it's going to be a pleasant evening. Looking at lows tonight, we're going to dip it down into the 60s in Dayton. 67 in Dayton. We'll keep it in the 60s closer to the Ohio Valley. Up to the north, though, 70s will be possible for overnight lows. Highs tomorrow are going to get warm in Toledo. We'll be nearing that 90 degree mark in Dayton. We're going a high of 88 degrees. Overall, heat continues to dominate the west. We stay cooler, but we do get a taste of that heat come Monday. As you can see, the next 10 days, we're looking at a warming trend through Monday with temperatures above normal, but then we drop back to below normal or right around that normal temperature of 84 degrees throughout the rest of the week to come. On Live Doppler 2 HD right now, we are tracking a few storms in Indiana. Very isolated event, slow moving to the southeast. These storms, if they hold up, could impact Salina, but they're likely going to lose energy as we lose sunlight later on this evening. Live Doppler, or now we take a look at our satellite radar imagery where we are dealing with this storm system to our north. That's the reason behind these storms moving through Illinois and Indiana right now. A slim chance for some of those to impact northern Ohio, especially into tomorrow. Overall, our next big weather system is still brewing over the Rocky Mountains right now. That's that tracks across the country. Our rain chances are going to go up this week, starting Monday night and then into Tuesday. That's when we're going to see the most rain. A few scattered storms could linger on into Wednesday. Here's a breakdown on future track for the next few hours. As you can see, isolated storms remain possible into the night, but overall most of the Miami Valley stays dry. Uh, some storm development is still possible tomorrow, kind of along that same boundary where storms develop today could impact our northern counties, but as you can see, most of us stay clear and will be mostly sunny to partly cloudy tomorrow. The air quality advisory does continue through Sunday night. Here's a breakdown. We are seeing a current air quality index of 64 today and tomorrow. We do have a chance to reach 104. 86 degrees right now in Dayton, Windsor out of the southwest at 13 miles per hour. Notice our dew point is at 64. That still, for the most part, keeps us mostly sticky, but we are getting close to that uncomfortable mark. Looking ahead to Sunday and Monday, we'll likely see dew points around 64, 65, 66 possible throughout the day on Monday. And so that does put us up to that kind of uncomfortable level when it comes to humidity. So keep that in mind. You might sweat a little bit more than you're used to. Make sure you are drinking some water. 87 degrees right now in Troy, 86 in Dayton. Tonight we take temperatures down to 67. Tomorrow you're high 88 degrees.